You know, there were so many topics on the table during Wednesday's committee meeting, putting vice and presidential candidates on the local ballot, funding primaries and paper ballots. But the hot issue just before the break was whether or not there'd be new voting machines for this election. Elections officials have maintained that there's no money in the budget to fund an election or purchase new voting machines, but they have identified the machines they want. During questioning by Senator Usi Richards, it came out that there are federal funds available. What, as we speak today, April 11, 2012, that prevents you from buying these new monies or reprogramming your federal money to buy the new machine? Elections officials say because they haven't relocated their St. Thomas office, they're not compliant with the American Disabilities Act, so those funds can't be considered. They say they've done their part. They're not the holdups. Because the board, the election system, again, is attached to the executive branch, property and procurement procedures, uh, we are unable to move forward at this point. I don't want this election to go by without a new set of machines when they are it in place. And we have uh, monies that can be reprogrammed. What do we need to do to reprogram it? It requires that the board uh, establish a community-based committee to revisit our state plan, uh, to reprogram the money so that they can be available to purchase the machine. Senator Hansen says the process is too lengthy and she suggested taking property and procurement out of the equation. What do we need to do now? Can we get rid of property and procurement and make you responsible and liable? Elections officials all agreed with a resounding yes, but said realistically because of requirements under the federal government, there would not be enough time to do what's needed if the funds came federally. So senators are considering finding the money locally. What I would really like to understand, assuming that this body could work out something where you get money for new machines. When you comply with HAVA, are we going to get reimbursed or can we get reimbursed? Abramson said the funds would be reimbursable, but there's still a question of money for the general election. Erica Parsons, News 2.